Let's take a look at fractions on a T eighty two calculator. I've got my tablet. Okay. First one we're gonna look at is forty over seventy two. Now I want to simplify this. Okay. Now forty over seventy two. We'll do forty divided by seventy two. Enter and you get a decimal, and then we do math, and you see fraction is our first one there. Then we'll do enter, enter, and then that tells us that that reduces to five ninths, and that's our answer. Uh, here we're going to add two fractions, so I got one over 36 plus two over 27. Okay, I'm going to press clear to clear the screen. Okay, so I do 1 divided by 36 plus 2 divided by 27. Enter. And you get a decimal. And to change decimal to fraction, uh, again, we do math. Enter, enter. And that gives us 11 over 108. Third one, we'll take a look at is subtracting two fractions. We got two fifths minus one third. I'm going to press clear to clear the screen. And we got two divided by five minus one divided by three. Enter. And we get decimals, so we do math, enter, enter. And that gives us one fifteenth. For the most part, fractions, you just enter them as you see them. We're going to see the exceptions to that, though. Here, I got uh, 14 over 21 times 9 over 7. Okay, so we've got 14 uh, divided by um, 21 times 9 divided by 7. Enter, and then we get a decimal, and we do math, enter, enter. And that gives us six sevens. Okay. Our fifth one. Division. This is one you have to do a little bit different. Last one you do also, but this one, 20 over 27, divided by... 10 eighteenths. Now when you're dividing a fraction by a fraction, what you have to do is you have to put the first fraction inside of parentheses and put the second fraction inside of parentheses. Otherwise you will not work. So, press clear to clear that. I'm going to do a beginning parentheses. 20 divided by 27. Closing parentheses divided by beginning parentheses. 10 divided by 18, and close parentheses. Again, I put parentheses around the first fraction, parentheses around the second fraction, and divide in between them. And then press enter, and I get a decimal, so I do math, enter, enter. And that gives us four thirds. Okay, let's look at our last fraction. We've got uh, one third plus one-fifth all over one-seventh divided by two. This is a complex fraction. Complex fraction is a fraction inside of a fraction. Whenever you have more than a single number or a single variable on top or bottom of a fraction, you need to put parentheses around it. So up on top here, we have more than a single number or a single variable, so put parentheses around it. On the bottom, we have more than a single number um, or single variable, so put parentheses around it. Now, other than that, you just kind of enter it as you see it. So, press clear to clear that. I do a beginning parentheses, 1 divided by 3, plus 1 divided by 5. Closing parentheses, divided by beginning parentheses, 1 divided by 7, minus 2, and then closing parentheses. And then we do an enter, and we get a decimal, so we then do a math, enter, enter. 
and that gives us negative 56 over 195. And that's our answer. And that's how to handle uh, fractions on a T-82 uh, calculator.